Hello everyone, I'm Tim. Let's talk about Higao Nakanryo, teacher of such legendary masters as Mabuni Kenwa, Shinpan Shiroma, and of course, Miyagi Chojun. At the end of this video, I added some footage of one of Master Higaona's most important kada, Zanshin. I don't believe there is any footage of this kada being performed by Kanryo himself, so I instead chose to use a video of Zanshin as performed by Higaona Morio. And watching him perform any kada is a real treat, so stay tuned for that. <laughs> Higaona Kanryo was born in 1853 in Naha. He is one of the Okinawan masters who brought Fujian White Crane Kung Fu from China to Okinawa to make it his fighting style and teach it to his students. Higaona was born to a merchant family that occupied themselves with shipping firewood to Naha. When he was 14 years old, he started monk fist boxing under Master Aragaki. Although the word karate was not commonly used back then, I might use it in this video anyway, as we're referring to Okinawan unarmed combat. Now other ter terms that can be used are te, todi, or even uchinari. When Higaona was in his late teens, he was able to travel to Fujiao. This was a big deal as this was in full Meiji restoration times, and Okinawans traveling to China wasn't something that was easily allowed. So he had to pretend he had to travel to become an Okinawan translator for officials in Beijing. In Fuzhou, Higaona was able to train under someone we know as Ru Ru Ko. Although his actual name was never recorded, we do see his name pop up every now and then. Among other kata, Higaona learned Kururunfa from Ru Ru Ko. There are some theories that this kata was named after this master, though I can't confirm that. Miyagi said the following about Higaona. My sensei is incredibly strong. I cannot conceive what hard training sensei underwent in China. Kanryo's sensei's speed and power are truly superhuman. His hands and feet move faster than lightning. Some stories say Higaona trained so hard his hips, legs and feet were in agony and that he even had blood in his urine from training. After over a decade of studying martial arts in China, Master Higaona returned to Okinawa to continue the family business and to teach his fighting system in and around Naha. His style was known for combining both hard go and soft ju techniques in harmony. Higaona Kanryo was noted for his powerful Sanshin Kara and his students used to say the floor was hot after M Master Higaona had gripped it with his feet while performing his Sanshin. Now as promised, I'll share a video of another great Goju Ryu master performing this same kata. So without further ado, here is Master Higaona Morio with Sanshin. Sanshin kata emphasizes the coordination of the body and mind through the control of muscle tension combined with controlled breathing.
So this is a story of Master Hirona Kanryo's younger years. If you liked it, go ahead and watch the videos about his students. I'll leave links in the description down below. There are videos about Miyagi, Mabuni and Shiroma or click here to go straight to the playlist with videos about these masters and more. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Let me wish you a wonderful day and as always, thanks for watching.